Hey guys, uh, um, I had stumbled upon this uh, company, uh, KRP. Um, basically, what they do is acquiring, owning mineral and royalty interests in oil and natural gas properties in the U.S. Um, if you're looking for dividends, um, this may not be a bad play. Um, it's not at the cheapest price right now. This is the range, 13 to 17. But, um, I mean, they took a dip in the pandemic. Well, it would have really been a great price if you could have picked it up at six. Um, but I was looking at their um, presentation here. Uh, I just went to their website and it looks really solid. Um, And it's still under undervalued according to a lot of these analysts. I'm just gonna scroll down. Just showing some of the sites. This is uh, their history. They had a lot of acquisitions. This was interesting to me. It says that many states mineral and royalty interests are considered by law to be real property interests and are thus afforded additional protections under bankruptcy law. Mineral interest owner entitled to 15 or 25 percent of production revenue. KRP issues a lease that says KRP receives an upfront cash bonus payment and customarily a 20 to 25 percent royalty <laughs> on production revenues. In return, KRP delivers the right to explore and develop with the operator being 100, bearing 100 percent of the cost for a specified lease term. The leased minerals, the KRP gets 20, 25%. The operator gets uh, 75 to 80%. But the operator is taking on all the costs. So, I mean, it sounds like a great deal to me.
This is just their financials and um, this was the third quarter highlights. Fifty one cent per unit. So you're buying the unit for fifteen something and um, you're basically getting four well, it looks like uh, fifty one times four they play pay quarterly. So you get two dollars two dollars a year per unit. And the, uh, this thing IPO'd in 2017, so it really hasn't been out um, that long. So I think the uh, chances of this uh, company growing are probably very high. And they get 99 rigs drilling. I don't know what this means. I don't know if that's 20,000 barrels. Um. 20,000 barrels of oil been out of the ground every day. I'm not 100% not sure. You know, I'm not an expert in this. I'm just an average Joe. Cash distribution 51 cent. Payout ratio 75%. Implies a 12.7 annualized yield based on closing price of 16.11. So, you know, if you purchase this today and you want to, even if the price doesn't go up, you're getting a, a almost a 13% dividend. And uh, to me, that looks very attractive. And to me, the market cap is fairly high. So, you know, anything over a billion, I would say, is the chain. You know, it's not like a $30 million company. So this thing's been around. They kept, they know what they're doing. They're continuing to make acquisitions. Um. looks like a really good deal to me um, I mean granted the P ratio is over 10 uh, would be nice if it's a little lower um, but um, just glancing at this very briefly the only question I have is you know, they earned a dollar twenty nine, but they paid out two dollars. So, you know, is this sustainable? You know, is the payout um, sustainable? And I, th I think it. I think it probably is. I mean, I don't know how they paid two dollars if they only made a dollar, but. Um, and just as a note of caution, looks like they, you know, lost money, a substantial amount of money these, these two years, but then 
this year and the last two looks like they made money so um, take it with a grain of salt but uh, this um, looks like if you're looking for dividends this could be a uh, um, a small piece of your pie maybe perhaps all right thank you